Okay, here we go. Blue team, are you ready? Thumbs up. Red team, are you ready? Thumbs up. Okay, autonomous in three, two, one, go. All right, starting things off here again, 99, 999, going for the tried and true. Interesting. How many will they get? So 1437X actually switched sides with 3759X for this match. What do you think the strategy there was? It looked like they were trying to grab both the mobile goals, which would have given them the autonomous lead. But since they didn't get either of them, it looks like it's going to go to 999V and 1437Z. So Red will win autonomous. Driver control in 3, 2, 1, go. All right, so David, this is potentially the final match here at Clash. It's pretty exciting, honestly. Yeah, I was going to say, do you think that we're going to see some kind of strategy change? Because you can see that 99999 didn't get as many... Uh, they didn't get as many... Uh, the donuts, yeah. yeah. They didn't get as many purples, purples as they did last time. Well, what's interesting here is 1437X might get DQ'd if they de-score any of those purple things on that. I was oh, it's close. Oh. It's close. I was about to say, he's playing with fire there. You can see that one of those isn't even wrapped around the center. It's simply just hanging on the side. Yeah, they're playing very well, though. They already have two bases scored. It looks like 1437X is going to try to take that mobile base over. Let's see what 1437Z is going to do. Are they going to be able to Are they going to be able to make the bases fall? It doesn't look like they're falling. It looks like they're balanced too perfectly. I'm wondering how this is going to go because I can see that he stole the blue base, but where is he going to go with it? I was going to say for the first time the the blue team has more of the they have more of the neutral bases. It looks like the blue team is actually going to Win at the this. The blue team does. I, I think they have a lead here. They do have a lead. And what's interesting is now they can't touch their. If they um, can get this on. This is going to be huge. They got it on. Can they defend this final neutral post? I don't think it matters. Well, there's another right screen on the field. This means that we will have to redo the match. I was going to say, do you think this is, how do you think this is going to impact the blue team's morale going into the rematch? I think they played this match very well, and I think they were going to win it. It just sucks. I was going to say, this was a very well-played match by the blue team. So I'm wondering, will they learn from what happened this game and try to adapt, or will the red team adapt faster? I'm, I'm not sure, honestly. It didn't even seem like there was much of a strategy change besides moving their robot to the other side. Are you a... Just honestly, really sucks for the Blue Alliance here.
Looks like we're getting ready here to replay that match. All right, blue team is taking a timeout for the red team. Very good display of sportsmanship here.
Here we go. The final match is going to commence. What's interesting is 1437X is now setting up against 1437Z, which is what we saw in the first match, but not in the second. Do you think that there's some kind of strategical play at hand here? I mean, there has to be. Why else, why else would they switch positions? Well, well, but who do you think would have won the last game if the score was counted? <laughs> the score was counted. Blue definitely had it. Well, that's what I'm saying. So why would they change it? Not sure. It's up to them. Okay. Post Blue Alliance, are you ready? Red Alliance, are you ready? Autonomous in three, two, one, go. Here we go. The fight. Right, let's see. 1437. Oh X God. taking it. Wow. For the first time, we see that 999 didn't actually get any of the purple Pringles. This is going to be a huge lead already. Four. How interesting. That's actually huge. We'll see if it freaks them out or not. Driver control in three, two, one, go. All right, David. I'm very curious to see how this is going to shape up here. For the first time, Team 99999 doesn't immediately have a colossal lead with their phenomenal strategy and use of the Purple Pringles. Looks like Red is already... Oh, 1437X. <laughs> Blue immediately going in and grabbing a second. Calling the, calling, watching out for the pinning. He's at his driver's race in. That's what we've seen him do all day. The blue team has definitely changed something between this and last game. Like, look at this development. But 1437Z successfully knocking over. All right, here we go. 14, 14. 1437Z, can they deposit this onto their platform? Yes, they can. Yo, and here's 99. All right, there we go. That was very interesting. I've never seen that before. If 1437 balances out, this could work. It's a very messy match. Stealing the Red Alliance goal, is, putting it. How is this going to play out? The blue team currently does have two of the neutral goals as well as one of the Reds on their platform. I'm not even sure how they're carrying this neutral goal, but Things they got it. do not look good for the Red team right now. It looks... We'll see how it goes. We'll see. Right now, it looks like Blue is in the lead. I was going to say, but I they have the two Blue neutrals. team has a phenomenal lead in this right now. I'm not really sure. Well, because Blue is... It looks like 1437Z. I think that's, that's going to be it. That'll be the end of the... Second match. What a messy match compared to compared what to seen. the first one. The first was a very clean, decisive victory for the red team. They came in with the game plan and everything worked out for them. Game two, crisis struck. It looks like. Are, do you think there's going to be a, another timeout for this one? I mean, there are no more timeouts, so he, they there just have no to figure it out. That's right. This is what happened. <laughs> This is potentially detrimental here. If they don't take the win on this one, I don't know if they're going to be able to come back. They're going to have to switch up their strategy or something. This is definitely a... I'm not liking, I'm not liking how this looks. Let's see how many Pringles they have stacked right now. It looks like it's seven purple Pringles, which is the exact amount you need to cancel out a base and be up one point. We will see. Blue's probably going to take it based on my terrible announcer math. It's going to be a close one. It depends on the call. It's right now we're hearing that blue may have touched the red robot as it was touching. It was touching the glass. Okay, we're going to see. These rulings could change. 
the outcome of the get match. It's going to be very close. There we go. 1437X did contact the platform during the last 20 seconds. And that is, uh, then we have to determine did that affect gameplay? It was determined by the refs that it did not affect gameplay. Therefore, it's the same as an elevated robot in their opponent's uh, platform. So that was scored that way. Just to let everybody know. This is huge news from the head ref. This may make the difference. The score is coming up right now. We will see. The Red Alliance does take it. There it is. With that ruling. That'll be the end. It was a great day, and it came down to a lot of hard work. And thank you so much for Patriot Robotics and Berturso for coming out and playing here today. It was a really, really close few matches. Obviously some technical difficulties and much other stuff, but it was really close at the end of the day. It was definitely a good outcome. A lot of, it was a lot of fun to watch and uh, yeah, congratulations, for the Red, congratulations to the Red Alliance for coming out on top. Yes.